Another quick Oracle clip. Let's learn how to control Oracle VirtualBox at the command line using VBox Manage. Let's go. From the command line of the host operating system, let's start with viewing the list of supported operating system types. Let's enter the VBox Manage command and then the subcommand list and the option OS types. The output is a list of all supported OS types. When creating a new virtual machine providing the OS type, let's VirtualBox know what operating system we intend to install as the guest OS once the virtual machine is running. Selecting an OS type does not install the guest's OS. So let's use this OS type. Now let's create the virtual machine. Let's use the VBox manage create VM command followed by a few options. First, the name option. This name is used by default as the name of the settings file that has the .vbox extension and the machine folder, which is a subfolder of the virtual box VM directory. Let's enter a specific name for the virtual machine. Now recall the ID of the OS type that we will use for the virtual machine and enter it following the OS type option. By default, the VBox Manage Create VMs command creates only the XML configuration for the VirtualBox machine, but does not register the virtual machine. Let's register the virtual machine with VirtualBox by adding the register option. If you are running VirtualBox version 7.0 or older, then this command will create and register the VM. If you are running VirtualBox version 7.1 or newer, then this command will run but you can also specify the platform architecture for the VM. Add this option to specify either an ARM or x86 architecture. When done, run the command. The command output shows that the virtual machine has been created and assigned a UUID and an XML machine settings file. Since we registered this new virtual machine with VirtualBox, it is now listed in the graphical user interface. This virtual machine still requires a guest OS installation and some additional setup of its properties before use. You can see more clips here, and don't forget to subscribe to always get the latest.